Secondary Victims by June Kavner. When an abuser is named, what we don't realise is all the other people who now get victimised. It's only human nature, whenever we're in pain, to look outside ourselves for someone else to blame. Although without intention, this causes untold pain, countless innocent families are left with guilt and shame. Guilt by association is how some families feel. Mothers in particular get the raw end of the deal. It's assumed they let it happen. It's believed they must have known. No benefit of the doubt or compassion ever shown. For mothers who are innocent, we must try to understand how much they need to be believed and offered a helping hand. Vilifying mothers will only make them weak. For improvement, what we need is to encourage them to speak. Because there are no answers, this crime is unexplainable. We gain no understanding, which makes closure unobtainable. The families of abusers always seem to pay for the crime. The abuser may get the sentence, but the families do the time. It's time we offered help to all. Now we know what's involved. Innocents are suffering. That must be resolved. This crime leaves many victims and breaks many hearts with far too many innocents whose lives are torn apart. Think on this the next time you hear a story on the news. There's more involved than what you see in a story of abuse.